What is up, all you beautiful people? It is your boy Michael here, play this for you, and welcome to episode 10 of a Hardcore Iron Man Randomized Nuzlocke Season 3 featuring Pokemon Emerald. And we're going to check out this house here. Um, sometimes you can actually make your way through the Trick Master. As long as it's the cut one uh, or another one, we can actually make it through. So if we can't, well, you know, it's not really a big deal. We'll just leave. Uh, and I, oh, okay, we can make it through, so we're gonna be going. Welcome. Welcome, 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 everyone. For those of you that are new, thank you all so much. I truly appreciate it. If you don't know what a hardcore Iron Man randomized Nozaki is, that is an Articuno. Holy shit. Huh. I don't like that. Hmm. I am bug and rock types. That's not good for us. It's not. We're bringing in Delta. We gotta hit this thing. For those of the new, for those of you, oh my gosh, that are new, thank you. Truly appreciate it. Go ahead and check out the link in the description down below for the rules of what a hardcore man randomized Nuzlocke is. Delta should be okay here. Gust. All right. We need to hit this thing. It is imperative. Good job, Delta. I believed in you. Okay. So this is risky. But here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna switch into Carl. It's flying and ice type. So if we land this rock throw and Articuno doesn't wake up, we're fine. But I know this Articuno is going to be faster than us. Now we just need to hit. And I think we one hit. I'm pretty sure we one hit. We do. Hell yeah. Good job, Carl. Absolute legend. Yeah, but go ahead and check out the link in the description down below for the rules of what a hardcore Iron Man randomized Nuzlocke is. I am the inventor of the hardcore Iron Man randomized Nuzlocke. And if you guys end up liking what you're seeing... Go ahead and click on that link in the description down below. It's the playlist for this entire series. Feel free to hit that subscribe button. I upload every day at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I'm going to do that for over a year. So you guys don't want to miss any of that content. For those of you that are returning, thank you all so much. Truly appreciate each and every one of you. You guys are amazing. Honestly, you really are. You guys make this possible. I love interacting with you in the comments section. And if you guys end up enjoying the content, just go ahead and hit that like button. Honestly, the best way to support me. The best way to support me, if you're already subscribed. So there's actually not a lot of trainers here, and we just get to chill on over here. I think there's two. Uh, but we have to use cut a lot, so... Not really a big deal. Not really a big deal. It's Saturday, so I hope you guys are having a fantastic, fantastic weekend. Hope you guys got some stuff planned. Community day is... It's either today or it's tomorrow. I'm not sure yet. I don't know because it's Wednesday when I'm recording these, so <laughs> I'm actually not entirely sure myself. But I know it is either the day of this recording or the day after, so I do know that much. So hopefully you guys catch a lot of shiny charm manners. Wish you all the best of luck. Hopefully you guys are having some fun. If we're fighting this Loudred here, Jeff is an absolute unit. Absolute unit. Reggie Ice. Okay, we are going to switch here. Whew. Uh, Ronald, because for whatever reason, these uh, Reggies know explosion and self-destruct, so... I'm not risking it. Nightshade it is. And if they go for, you know, Icy Wind here, Ronald should be able to resist it. Shouldn't do a lot of damage. Oh, you don't like to see that. Hmm. Really don't like to see that. Speed is just falling. Ha. Huh. Uh, we'll switch into Lyle. Lyle should be fine, even if Reggie Ice goes for a self-destruct here. Even if it goes for self-destruct. We should be faster. Oh, that's a crit. That kind of sucks. Now I'm a little nervous. Pound. Okay. We KO. We're fine. I was a little nervous, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Electrode. Uh, we will switch into Delta, because she's got some fat HP. 
Got some fat HP here. So you know this thing goes for some sonic booms. We should be fine. Screech. Not too concerned about that, honestly. Cut does over half. That's what you like to see. As long as we hit, we're fine. We won't take any damage. Hey, there we go. Good job, Delta. Absolute legend. This will level her up for sure. 21. Jeez. She actually has better special attack. I was unaware of that. Hmm. That's interesting. Alright, we found a scroll. Don't really need to memorize it. Other than what our character says he does. We got one more trainer here. And I think we'll be fine. So we're going to be fighting it. Fighting it. And hopefully we get a nice little reward here. Clay doll. That's fine. It's ground type, which means our water gun is going to be super effective. Harden. Don't care, because we're going with that special attacking type move. Claydol was always an interesting Pokemon, I thought. With the Drew Claydol. Oh, what do we have now? Lantern? It's not really going to do anything for us, is it? It's water type. That was a crit. Hmm. Well. We're just going to bring in Lyle. Why Lyle? Oh, because... Oh, Flail, huh? Interesting that it would have went for that on a Rock-type Pokemon. I figured it was just going to go for a Water-type move, so we just switch out. Uh, well, getting a lot of speed drops this episode, aren't we? As long as Lantern just keeps doing three damage, I think we'll be okay. Yeah, we're going to be fine. That's a crit. If you guys have got your crit guesses in, go ahead and do that if you want your chance at naming our next starter in our Hardcore Iron Man randomized Nuzlocke. It's going to be Season 4. Wow, Lyle learned Mega Punch? What the hell? I didn't know Mew learned Mega Punch. That's insane. I know what we're doing. You guys don't know what we're doing yet. But I know. I know what game we're going to be running. And it's going to be awesome. hope you guys are going to be excited for that. I know I'm going to. It's going to be a great time. I might record one more episode today. Three might be good enough. I don't know. It just depends. Depends on how I'm feeling. Mud slap. It's going to lower our accuracy. Hopefully we don't miss. Ah, we did not. This should bump Jeff up to level 20. Oh, yeah. Some good stuff is happening, ladies and gentlemen. Some good stuff. God, Rachel was defeated. Okay. Well, we've done it. We've made it through the trickster house. Wrote down the secret code. Ah, yes. He sure is fabulous, isn't he? Thank you. What do I get? I am sharp. Oh, rare candy. Hell yeah. This is the first time we've gotten a rare candy in a, a hardcore Iron Man randomized Nuzlocke, which is awesome. We actually can't go back through there, by the way. I don't know if anyone ever tried, but you can't. It just doesn't let you. How's our team looking? How's our team looking? Uh, we'll take this off. I think we'll be fine. A nice little double battle here. We're definitely going to get into that. Hopefully they don't both have legendaries. As long as there's no water or grass type Pokemon, I'm pretty sure we're fine. Water is one of the most common types in the game, though. Wishkosh and Dragonair. Okay, well... I don't like to see either of those Pokemon, to be honest, but we're going to go with Rock Throw here and Cut on the Wishkosh. Thunder Wave on Delta is kind of unfortunate. Kind of saw that coming, though. Mudsport. Well, I'm not using any Electric-type moves, so... Ah, uh, Delta hit, so that's good. Oh, well, that's not very effective, is it? Hmm. 
for whatever reason, I thought it would be. Wrap. Alright, wish kosh. Just don't use a water type move. Just don't use a water type move. Water sport? Well, I mean, that is a water type move, but it doesn't really do any damage, does it? Ah, success. Okay, cool. Well, Dragonair has successfully been neutered. Because it is in level delta. So. <laughs> Twister. Does it hits both, but it's not really gonna do a lot of damage. Rock throw, well though will. It'll do a lot. Delta's paralyzed, can't really do anything. It's alright. Probably gonna have to go back and heal after this fight here. Which won't really be an issue. Immobilized by love. Sorry, Dragonair, you really didn't have a chance. Delta. Delta's kind of like a, uh, you know, she kind of leads people on. All right, let's get this item here. A shoal shell. I don't really know what that does. I think it heals when you hold it. So we get two cherry berries. Uh, I think the one in the middle is the lapa berry, and then, of course, two more cherry berries. So... Already ran over here, so we're gonna go get this item. A heart scale. It doesn't really do anything for us at all. Lepa, yes, I was correct. Alright. Well, it's another double battle here. Uh, potential battle there. Tell you what, we're not gonna go heal. I'm gonna do it off screen. I'm gonna run back to the other town. Just it does nothing. Okay. Well, Carl's up, so we're gonna fight here. I think we've got like three trainers left, so don't want to run back heal and then have something potentially bad happen. A whooper, huh? Hmm. A whooper. This is ground tight, so it should be fine here. Water gun. Ooh, that's not good. Don't do a lot, please. Hmm. Well, we have to switch. Ugh. Don't like that. Don't like that. While it is. We're going to use our Mega Punch, because why not? Pew! I know Mega Punch's accuracy is not 100. I don't know what it is. I think it's like 85 or something. Jigglypuff. Nope. We'll stay in. Hiya. Hit him with a good old punch. Alright. Christiana was defeated. Okay. Do we risk it? Oh, it's a double battle. Could be a little scary. Nope, I'm not going to. I'm just going to go heal at this one. <laughs> so I'll have a heal left at this Pokemon Center. Which, I uh, mean, it really should be enough to get us through. If not, we've got plenty of other heals left over at other places. Alright, so that's two here. We've got one, two, three, four heals. Uh, no, four, five, six heals left over right now. Way better than uh, how Generation 2 and Season 2 went. I really thought this one would be harder, but I guess with the two lucky eggs, you know, it is what it is. Alright, so we're actually going to take the lucky egg off of Lyle. Switch Lyle. With Roland. And give, uh, not Roland, Ronald the lucky egg. Alright. Another double battle. Hopefully it's just not something bad. Okay. I can deal with this. Can definitely deal with this. Rock throw on the Plusle and then Nightshade. And that should just KO the Plusle. Poison thing kind of sucks. Hopefully we don't get poisoned. 
course we do. <laughs> of course we do. We're going to have to use a uh, beautiful berry. Because I don't want to take a bunch of free damage. Don't want to take a bunch of free damage. Alright. Well. Hmm. We're going to switch here. And then use the berry. We actually have an antidote. We're going to use that because we can't plant those. Uh, I guess we have more than one. Don't we? Yeah, we do. <laughs> Alright. Ronald is cure. I'm switching car out because Nudo King's ground type. I can't really use magnitude here. It's going to hit Ronald. And uh, I really just don't want to hurt my own Pokemon. Oops, don't want the bag. So we can use Water Gun here and Nightshade and hopefully be able to KO. I don't know, though. I don't know how much HP Nino King has. Well, as long as Jeff can do that much, being a super effective attack, I think we'll be okay. Ah, we couldn't. What a legend. Nope. Never mind. I don't want to use a physical type move, either. Peck. That's fine. I'm just going to take a little bit more damage. Because this Nero King probably has Poison Point. Don't really want to, to do that. Right. Actually, shocked there. Ronald did not level up. Quite shocked. Man, we are just <laughs> Stu and Nick. Ma and Pa, Stu and Nick. You love it. You absolutely love it. All right. So we got a Poke fan here, but it is developer Cammy. Pikachu. Wow, that's actually hilarious. We're just going to go for Magnitude. Pikachu did a whopping one damage. Five. Hmm. Well, I don't think it's going to KO the Pikachu, unfortunately. Never mind, it did. Carl's going to hit level 21 as well. Hell yeah. Good stuff. Self-destruct? No thanks. Don't ever want to accidentally click that. That would not go well for us. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to wrap it up for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching, even though these annoying people like to give us their phone numbers. If you guys ended up enjoying this episode, just go ahead and hit that like button. If you're new, subscribe. If you want to see content like this every day, 9.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, I upload. Going to do it for every year, every single day. And until next time, I'll see all you beautiful people later. Thanks so much for watching.